If you don't already like what you see here, my friend, you need a good therapeutic dose of anime-style tactical RPGs. With card and board game elements. What I mean is, you need to learn how to have fun with gaming. For those like myself, I can picture you drooling all over the isometric level design and characters with colored hair. Imagine yourself as a treasure hunter in the distant future, searching for relics from days of old to protect humanity from extinction. Your liaison in this mad search to keep the flames of humanity burning is a guy in a Hawaiian shirt with a ponytail. Considering this is a game that would translate well to a fellow like himself, it's almost too appropriate. This is Battle Hunter for the PlayStation, developed by Success Corporation, published by Age Tech, and donated to CGR Undertow by Chip in Alabama. I'm not sure where Chip got a hold of this diamond in the rough, but he's got good taste. Tactical RPGs provide hundreds of hours of fun times, and Battle Hunter delivers them one roll of the dice at a time, making it feel like Final Fantasy Tactics if it were a board game. Along with the dice roll, you'll have a hand of cards that will boost your defense, increase the amount of spaces you can move, even let you set traps for unsuspecting rival hunters, which will slow their progress. But what exactly are you progressing to? What is the goal of the game? Well, each time you accept a mission from Hawaiian Shirt Guy, you'll be looking for a specific relic, whether it's a book, a lump of metal, or anything else that might save humanity that week. The objects might sound lame, but you'll have a blast looking for them. Plenty of obstacles lie in your path, most of all the three other hunters that want to get paid. When it comes to fisticuffs, everything is controlled by the dice. Roll lower than your opponent, and your attack will register zero. Whoever's getting attacked has the option to block, surrender, flee, or counterattack, and that will also be determined by a roll of the dice. If you happen to roll more than your opponent and have a selected card to use, that card will take effect as well. It's a simple but intelligent battle system that moves quickly and efficiently, and everything looks and sounds great to boot. Setting this tactical RPG apart from others is indeed the battles, which end after one attack. If a hunter loses all their HP, they are not knocked out, but simply transported back to the beginning, with half their total HP taken away. Leveling up is also entirely based on how much you've made off of selling relics, and the length of your time in the dungeon without the dragon beast gone is entirely reliant upon the number of cards left in the deck. It's a truly creative method of going through a tactical RPG, and one that will bring you many delightful hours of traipsing through dungeons, looking for funny objects. Pick up Battle Hunter if your favorite game list consists of Disgaea or Final Fantasy Tactics. <laughs>